was quite a piece of business. And maybe Barnett was behind the whole thing, but you still haven't got any proof. No, and I can tell you plenty more, but it still just adds up to suspicion. What I want you to do, Sheriff, is put an undercover man after Barnett. Try to get something on him. I don't know. That's mighty risky, spying on a man as prominent as Barnett. But I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll put one of my deputies on the case and see what we can find out. That's all I can ask for. He'll be able to get him when he starts out. Get set with your knife. All right. I'll take care of it the first thing in the morning. Thanks, Sheriff. Look out! <laughs> Can't catch him now. I guess not. Sheriff is probably combing the whole town for you, and you come back here. Safest place. Nobody could have seen us come in that alley entrance. We'll sneak out when things calm down. It's okay this time. After you get away, I got a job for you. I want you to run out that Stokes party or I'll never get his land. They'll be expecting us now. Probably even got some of their friends to back them up. And there's only two of us. Then you'd better scout their camp and see what you're up against. I'll send out what men I can and you let me know whether it looks like you can handle the job or not. Okay. I'll pick up that wagon load of powder at Ed's place on the way out. We might use it to blast their camp. Well, the sheriff is full of business now. He's sending out men trying to pick up Crean and Tosco. He still isn't very enthusiastic about going after Barnett. Well, you can't blame him too much. Barnett is a pretty prominent citizen. And we haven't any real evidence against him. Yes, I know. The most the sheriff would promise to do is have a man trail him if he leaves town. And he never leaves town. <laughs> You're right. But I'm afraid we're not going to get much help from that direction. So I'm going to try a new lead. Out of all the settlers camped around the reservation, Stokes is the only one that's been attacked. I'm going to find out why they picked on him. Do you think Stokes can tell you? Maybe. He's pretty friendly to a lot ago. I'll ride out there and have a talk with him. Jerry, why don't I wander into town and see if I can pick up some information about Barnett? It's a good idea. If you want me in a hurry, ride up to Pilot Peak, light a signal fire. I'll see it and meet you there. Bye. since I'd scraped the other day. None of the other camps have been attacked. Is there any reason why they should pick on you? None that I know of. Say, wait a minute. Just before the shooting started, two men tried to buy that section of land. They offered me $1,000. Hmm. Nobody's offered that to any of the other settlers. Is there anything particular about your section? <laughs> I don't know. I ain't seen it myself. You know, we can't go on the reservation until we get the final OK from Washington. Oh, yes, that's right. Well, I can ride in and look around. Which section is yours? 26. Wait a minute, I got a map I'll show you. There it is. Oh, yes, I can find that. Sure wish I could see what it looks like myself. Well, I'll let you know how it looks today.
up, Nancy? Maybe it doesn't mean anything, but I saw Barnett talking to three men outside the saloon, and he sent them up this way. Where'd they go? I don't know. I lost them in the canyon about a mile from here. That sounds like a pretty good lead. Maybe we better go back a ways and see if we can pick up the trail. All right. I'll show you where I lost them. Hand us to Barnett. Had I better go back now? Yeah, we won't need you. I'll take care of them. You ride up the canyon and watch for the others. If you see anyone coming this way, fire a shot. Be careful, Jerry. Oh. Hold it! Get rid of that gun. I'll get down. Where have you been? That's my business. If you ever tasted the whip price, it hurts. Step back. Dressing. Hurry it up. Hold it, Nancy, hold it. Jerry. You had the right man. He was headed back with a message from some bunch who were going to attack the settlers. I don't understand. Where is he and why the change of clothes? Well, I left him tied up. The main thing now is to stop the raid on the settlers. I don't know how many there are in that gang. They're up in the Lisa Canyon, right on the other side of that hill. I couldn't do any good just riding in on them. So why don't you take the Eladigo costume, ride up a ways where they can see you. I'm hoping that some of them will see you and take after you, and I can handle the rest of them. All right. Ready? Go. Get after it. Wait. There might be somebody with him. Hold it. Push your gun away. 